What's up guys, it's Novak, and if you're watching this, there's one of two possibilities you could have found this. Um, you could be watching it on Facebook right now, or you could be watching it on my YouTube channel, which is Somewhat Serious Gaming, for those of you who don't know. Um, and I'm going to take a little bit of a break to talk about something, two different things. Uh, the second half is going to be mainly for my uh, uh, gaming channel, so you, those of you who don't really care that much about it can just ignore that. And... Um, but the most important thing that I want to talk about is Star Wars is coming out. And not necessarily about Star Wars itself, but um, I work at a movie theater, for those of you who don't know. And uh, I just wanted to share a little bit of tips uh, when coming to see Star Wars. First things first, um, I know that we're going to be super packed. Um, I don't know how bad other theaters will be, but uh, I know that our theater is going to be pretty packed. Um, I know we've, we've probably sold out an entire thing of Star Wars already and it hasn't even come out yet but um being that it's going to be packed being that there's going to be a lot of people there and a lot of uh, workers um one thing to keep in mind please is that we are doing our best um I'm not saying that you know if a worker comes up to you and says something completely rude to you then that's that's uncalled for but you know if you know there's a long line and there's you know all the registers open you know there's no one just sitting around doing nothing please keep into a consideration that we have to deal with a lot of people uh, that day or any of the days that we um, that were uh, playing it um, so if any of you you know have gone to the movie theater and had a bad experience please keep in mind that uh, during Star Wars it's probably gonna be a lot of stress on us I'm not saying that we can't handle it I know that we can but um, just in case that someone has had a really stressful day I know I've had some of those uh, please keep in mind of that and try to be you know a little respectful for those who you know try to do their best um, another thing is um, if you can buy your tickets online definitely a good idea I mean those of you who are hardcore Star Wars fans have probably already done this but um, and those of you who don't know I don't know if many theaters I'm not gonna really name specifically which one mine is but um, those of you who do know where I work um, I know that we whenever you buy tickets online you can either print them out early or whenever you come in you can hand the card to us which is so much faster than handing like a confirmation number because you know you gotta type in the numbers there's no real scanning thing so if you hand the card to us we swipe it and we get it done real fast so like before you come see Star Wars try and think about how you can help yourself by making it a lot faster for us because then it'll make it a lot faster for you as well um, one last thing, uh, this is probably the biggest thing in my opinion, is um, <sighs> please keep the spoilers to yourself. Uh, I know J.J. Abrams is keeping a lot of things about Star Wars tight and secret because it's probably going to be something super good and I can't wait to see it. But for those of you who like to talk about the movie after the movie, please, 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 please. I, I, I can't add enough pleases in this sentence. Um, please keep that to yourself until you leave the building. Um, I don't, if I, I don't want to be rude, but if I have to hear a Star Wars spoiler or something super important to the story while I'm cleaning the theater, I, I mean, I'm personally going to see it hopefully the 22nd and the 24th or the 21st, one of those two days. So I've got like a little bit of time to wait, but I know I'm going to be working that Thursday night, so if, if the first show gets out and then someone says something, you know, it slips like, oh, Lucas is a bad guy, oh, this, that, and the other. Like, you know, obviously something stupid like that or something that's, like, big to the story, um, I'm not going to be the very happiest person in the world about that, let me tell you. But um, try to keep, again, try to be a little bit respectful on the people who are there, not even just for the workers, you know, some of the workers. I know a lot of people that I work with want to go see Star Wars. Um, I mean... For those of you who don't, like, I don't know what you're doing, but, um, and, uh, it's your own opinion, but, uh, my point is, like, not only for the workers that want to see Star Wars, but for the people who are about to go see Star Wars, like, keep that stuff to yourself. You could ruin a fan's biggest dream to see Star Wars and just, just ruin their whole entire time, like, or some teenagers or some younger kids who, you know, want to learn as much about Star Wars, you don't want to ruin their day. I mean, come on now. Um, so yeah, uh, get your tickets early, make sure you get their stuff, like, you know, you don't have to do any of this, I'm really not forcing you to do it, I can't really enforce you to do it, but, um, if anything at all gets through, please be respectful of other people, please try to be as nice as possible, don't say any spoilers, you know, I'm sure you've all probably heard this a thousand times, but, um, you know, it is our duty to clean the theaters, 
and a lot of people end up leaving a lot of stuff in the theaters and you know I'm not gonna I'm not gonna be the one to get on a rant about that but if we're cleaning a theater and it's particularly messy please don't uh, say anything rude to us we we try our best we do as fast as possible as much as we can and we know that star wars is going to be crazy and we want to do the best we can to help you guys out get in there and enjoy your movie um so you know you don't have to say thank you or anything like that i mean we we don't I, i'm not asking you to say that but what i'm asking you is please be a little respectful about how we do what we do you know and for those of you who were just on about the Star Wars thing, I'm going to post something on Facebook about this. So if you're just, you know, watching this for the Star Wars aspect of it, you can leave now. It's going to be a little bit more gaming specific. So thank you for watching, by the way. Um, I really appreciate you taking the time to watch this and also to, you know, take into consideration what I said. But anyway, uh, the more important thing for you, those of you who enjoy watching me game and stuff. Um, so Star Wars is coming out as you just heard. Um, I'm going to start working on Thursday, this coming Thursday, which, I mean, I'm posting this the same day, so you, you should understand which Thursday that is, the 17th. Um, it's coming out 18th. I know that I'm working on Thursday pretty late. Um, depending on my weekly schedule for Star Wars, I might be gone like 90% of the time. I mean, I'm going to be working my ass off for it. Um, so there may not be as many updates and uploads as possible. Um, I j did record about three or four sessions with Ryan um, in Terraria. So I've got a lot of that to put up. But what I want to try and do is uh, every day I'm going to be like Minecraft Monday, you know, Friendly Fire Fridays. I'm thinking about constraining or putting Terraria only on Tuesdays, Thursdays, or one of the other. I want to try and do like Tuesdays and Thursdays and then Wednesdays kind of like a random, I, I want to find something for Tuesday, Wednesday too, but uh, I'm going to attempt to do um, one video a day and then go from there because Star Wars is going to make me cringe, um, but uh, for now that's the schedule, it's going to be Monday's going to be Minecraft Mondays if we have it, Tuesday's going to, Tuesday and Thursday is going to be Terraria if we have it as well, and Friday you know, Friendly Fire Fridays if we have it. But uh, I do have a few other videos recorded, like Alien Isolation, stuff like that, that should be going up today as well. Um, so yeah, that's that's the schedule for this. Um, any days that I have off, I'm definitely going to be trying to do more stuff. Uh, it's like a pretty long video already. Um, well, I hope you guys enjoyed this little update. Uh, leave a comment, a like, whatever. Uh, especially comment... Um, Please let me know what you think, uh, anything about that. That would be great. Um, if you have any suggestions for me, what to play, what you want to see me do, like, oh, go back to Lovely Planet, I want to see you rage again, I, I'm going to get to that, trust me. Um, but please let me know. Uh, I'm all about hearing your feedback, and that would be great. Um, so anyway, have a good morning, evening, and night, wherever you are watching this. And as always, stay awesome, guys. Later.